In this video, we're going to talk about using tab stops in Word. So you could go to the Home tab, go to the Paragraph group, and click this little dialog launcher box. And then from this, we could click Tabs. And you have the ability to go ahead and, and type in all this information and select the type of alignment you want. But in my opinion, there's an easier way to do that. We're going to go to the View tab here at the top. And in the Show group, we're going to go ahead and reveal our ruler here. And notice it went ahead and put those rulers here at the top. Now, from here, we have our different types of tab stops. By default, it selects the left tab. And so with my cursor here in the first line, I'm going to go ahead and select the five inch mark on the ruler. And with my cursor here in front of the text, if I hit tab, notice it went ahead and put our text right here, left aligned to this tab stop. And if I click and drag it around, notice that the text slides with it. Now, let me go ahead and show you the right align. We'll do that. And this time I'm going to select a, a few lines of text to show you the difference. I'm going to go ahead and put my cursor here. Now with all three of those lines selected, I've set the tab stop for each one of those. And so if we go ahead and put our cursor here, notice that for each of these lines, that when I hit my tab key, that it aligns here to the four inch mark, but it does it from the right hand side. And so you have a lot of different ones here. You have a decimal and we also have, which we didn't talk about, the center align right here, which just puts the text in the center of that. It's an easy way to go ahead and set your tab stops by using the rulers instead of going through all the dialog boxes.